Uh, to ask the Scottish Government when it will next meet North Ayrshire Council. Cabinet Secretary. Thank you. Uh, ministers and officials will continue to regularly meet representatives of all Scottish local authorities, including North Ayrshire Council, to discuss a wide range of issues as part of our commitment to working in partnership with local government to improve outcomes for the people of Scotland. On the 24th of August, I met with representatives of North Ayrshire Council at Adrosan Academy to announce the rollout of free sanitary products across all schools, colleges and universities in Scotland. One of those representatives included the then Chief Executive, Elma Murray, who is set to retire soon, and I'd like to put on record my thanks to her for her unstinting commitment to the people of North Ayrshire and her commitment to public life. Yeah. Jamie Green. I uh, thank the Minister for that response. Can I place on record too my thanks to Elma Murray and wish her uh, successor uh, the very best of luck uh, in that role. Uh, but the reality is that, like many local authorities, North Ayrshire Council has been on the receiving end of Scottish Government cuts in recent years. In the last Scottish budget, it saw a £5 million reduction in its funding. I'm glad Mr Gibson thinks this is funny. Given that we now know that the Scottish Government's block grant is going up, would the Minister agree with me that there is really no justification for further cuts to North Ayrshire's budget? Cabinet Secretary. Uh, it might be Halloween. He's certainly had a nightmare with that uh, supplementary uh, <laughs> presiding <laughs> officer um, because despite the rhetoric from the Conservatives, austerity is far from over. In fact, we continue to experience the cuts of the UK uh, government. Our uh, resource block grant has been cut and will almost be £2 billion lower in real terms for 2019-20 compared to 2010-2011. That's the reality of the fact for yeah. Jamie Green and he should recognise that this government continues to treat local government fairly but he has to realise and look a bit closer to home for where the cuts start. Yeah.